morning you guys. I am coming outside today to show you Lincoln's new car seat. I've never been excited about a car seat before, but I've also never had a car seat as nice as this one before. So Graco is sponsoring this video today and because it is windy and because it is hot and because Joel is in the backyard being so loud, I'm going to get in the Suburban. Did you hear that? I'm gonna get in and show you all about this new car seat. Oh my goodness. It already feels better in here than it does out there. It is so hot. How many degrees is it? It is 98 degrees outside, so it's pretty hot. Some of you are going, uh, it's way hotter where we live, so get over it. No, just kidding. This is the Graco three-in-one car seat. What that means is that it functions as a rear-facing harness, forward-facing harness, and a high back belt booster. Rear facing is five times safer for your child so you want them to be rear facing for as long as possible. My number one complaint for rear facing is that I feel like their legs run out of room. This car seat comes with an extra extender that gives you five extra inches for their little legs as they grow. My favorite feature is that it adjusts so stinking easily. So you don't have to re-thread the harness through the back every single time the kid grows, which is every other week. Do you like your new car seat? Do you like your new car seat? You fit like a dream. You fit like a dream. What do you say we keep it clean for more than a day? This does detach and you can machine wash it, which I feel like is awesome. This is going to be the perfect car seat for all of our summer road trips, huh, Lincoln? You agree. Kick your foot up and relax. If you guys want to check out Graco's full line of car seats, I will make sure to leave their link in the description below. Daddy has a little surprise for you this morning. And me. He, yes, he's bringing you something. It's right. gonna be dinner. Yeah, something to I eat. Don't eat. That's you don't want to eat. You don't want to eat something. <laughs> well, it's you. What? It's not that food is not surprises. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Last night we did better. We did better. He slept for two hour increments instead of 30 minute increments. So I was still up like every hour and a half, two hours with him. Um, but he, <laughs> he's so sad. He's just like, he's just a little miserable. The night times, the night times are hard. He does not really do well at night. Um, he just cries and cries and like, one at one point like I just lay there had my hand on his head and we both just cried like I cried because I felt so bad like I felt so useless and I, I know how it felt like I remember just dreading going to sleep at night when I had my tonsils out because I knew how much it would hurt and I don't know why the nighttime hurts so much I think it's because like you like open your mouth like it gets dry when you're breathing and I don't know it's just miserable. It just is. <gasps> Look what daddy has for us. Some breakfast. Oh, 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 oh. He, he said that uh, breakfast or food is not a surprise. Food is not a surprise. Look at these. I wasn't very happy that Joel was bringing home like sugary breakfast. Usually we try to buy something that's a little better, but. I don't feel so bad considering in the two months we've been out the kitchen and everything. This is the first time we bought donuts. Joel wanted to do something nice and Boston's just not having it. Lincoln. I did bring you a surprise drink though, bud. What? Milk? No. Milk is a surprise drink? Horchata. Oh. He's gonna love it. <laughs> He's like, I would like some of this. Oh, oh, let's don't do that. Normally, oh my gosh, I'm kind of cringing that we're eating down here, but the the guys um, are upstairs finishing the trim in the kitchen, so we have to stay out of it. My mom realized what a crap hole that um, I am living in at the moment, and so she's gonna come get 
my kids today again. Can you shine both of them? Where's your other one? Let's see. Shine them on the wall so I can see. There's a spider flashlight and there's a winky emoji flashlight. <laughs> These are the only things that have got you to be in bed happy. <laughs> Got your humidifier go. Whoop! Almost dropped the camera. Got the humidifier going. Did we put a diaper on him? Nope, we did not. Hey, should we get a diaper? Oh yes, I did. Yes, yeah, I did. did. Yes, yeah. I did. Uh huh. It is currently twelve thirty. So mm, closer to one. Is it closer to one? Yeah, <laughs> yep, we are going off Boston hey, hours. Where are we gonna go? So I'll see him in two hours. And then he'll go to sleep for 30 minutes. Go when we wake up. Where are we gonna go when you wake up? Yeah. Well, our countertops are coming, but if you wake up early enough, I'll take we'll take you to get some pancakes. Hey. <gasps> Does that sound like fun? Mm -hmm. That doesn't mean you get to wake up early though. Oh, he will. <laughs> we'll go get panty cakes in the morning. Hey. Good night. Good night, bud. You good night. Good night. You good night. We're gonna go tonight. We're gonna it is officially away. Christmas morning in the Holine household. So, last night Boston was up. We went to bed around one, like we showed you, and then he was up every like hour and a half. Oh, I just noticed his bruise on his wrist from the IV, which I don't think worked because then they ended up putting an IV down here. Anyway, he finally fell like asleep asleep around 4.30. That's kind of his golden time, like 4, 4.30, and he slept till about 7.30, so that was good. Anyway, in order to get him to stop crying this morning when he woke up, I gave him all these presents. I've been kind of holding on to things that people send so that I can give it to him. Someone even sent their own personal toys from home, which which I thought was super, super, super sweet. And amongst Boston's Christmas presents, someone sent me the sweetest little package. And amongst the sweetness was, the best part of all was the letter. And she says, when frustration, anger, insecurity knocks from time to time, invite it in for a cup of tea, talk to it, understand it, then take that sugar spoon and poke all these right in the eye. And I don't know, that made me smile, that made me laugh, and I will think about that every time I wear the cute little things that she sent. Plus, I really loved her cursive handwriting. That was really sweet. There's been so many, you guys, your intuition's amazing. Your intuition has been, fabulous on what to send. My take on like Boston surgery, my surgery, it's just like tough through it and get through it. But you guys, you send like the best three-year-old gifts. That's been what's got him through what he's going through. I'm coming down here to show you guys what Joel and I did all yesterday. So we got this room all the way, we got this room all the way cleared out. Boston Road Howdy back and forth in here while we set up our shelves and we're just starting to organize it. I'm excited to get it like more organized. So it's gonna look really cool in here. It's gonna free up a whole bunch of space um, like in here and through the house and the garage. And so we're gonna be able to like get our house really in order. Our countertops are here and I think I just want to flip and crawl out of my skin and like scream as loud as I can. These are the most freaking beautiful things that I have ever seen. Well first I want to show you this truck. This is how they came which they look awesome. Oh my gosh I'm gonna like refrain from like cuss words right now because these are beautiful you guys. Has anyone ever been so excited to see your faces? <laughs> Not As me? <laughs> I think people get a little taken back when they show up. I'm like, yes, you're here. Get in my house. Get in my house. Oh, they're beautiful. They're beautiful. Eek. <laughs> oh, that makes you cringe, that sound. <laughs> What? Would you look at it? Would you look at it? Would you look at it? Would you like it? Um, yeah. yes. It's <laughs> so not too gray at all. Oh, oh no, it's little amazing. Little bits here and there. That's, that's it's exactly. amazing.
Yeah. Where's your disc? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I got that on film. Loud, covering his ears. Yeah. His ears aren't big enough to, or his hands aren't big enough to cover your ears. We will start over here. This is the cabinet. This is the mantle. This is the other cabinet. This is the banister. I'll go slower so you can see. This, oh, oh, this is the banister. Um, I'm very happy. I'm very happy with it. I feel like the guys that came today did a really good job. And then here is the finished product in the kitchen. And we're not allowed to touch them. The glue is drying, the epoxy is drying. So we need to, the, um, the tile will go up to there so you won't see that but they put a piece in the window seal um, tomorrow we'll put the faucet in there um, yeah but anyway these are the finished cabinets and the, what we have left to do is the backsplash tile and the fireplace and then we're done they'll come back and they'll put a polish finish on the floor when everything is done and then we're done. Like, I can't believe that it's coming to an end. Even though it's long overdue, I can't believe it's here. <laughs> so I think this vlog has a lot of randomness to it. But to be honest, my brain has been really scattered. And I had like these envisions of like how I wanted to record the vlogs when I was like putting stuff in my cabinets and like the cupboards downstairs. And it's just, I just couldn't like. <laughs> I had a job to get done and I just had to do it. And Boston, like, he's been on my hip. Like, he's been Bye, on my hip. Daddy. He's saying Bye. goodbye. You have grease under your nose. Look at me. What's under your nose? Oh, what's going on? That looks like candy. Or, yeah, it's candy. That's candy. not like blood. Okay. <laughs> Don't you think we've just been, like, super busy? Hello. I feel like there's just never been Occupied. Projects. Yeah. There's nothing... I don't know. It's coming, it's coming to an end. So, anyway, thanks for bearing with us, and I hope that you were entertained by this video today. <laughs> we'll talk to you guys later. Bye.